Yo, what's up? Welcome back to Alpha Central, I'm your host Jack, and today we're taking a look at when men ignore women's attention in public. But let's jump right in, right after you subscribe, of course. Disclaimer, this video was made for strictly comedic slash artistic purposes. No offense is intended towards any individual featured in this video. This should be motivation to get into the gym. The women are looking not just because of the muscle, but because of the status. A very muscular man is more likely to have a higher social status and respect among his peers that women crave. I'm gonna go give it to my gym crush. Hey, I think you're really cute. Happy Valentine's Day. Uh, sorry, I'm allergic. <laughs> Who in the world brings a rose to the gym expecting to find their future partner? Hi. Huh? I was just saying hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> How are you? Honestly, I'm just trying to work out. Okay. Bro was like, nah, girl, not today. Let me focus on my workout. Plain and simple. Yeah. Can you spot me? Yeah, of course. Thank you. You're welcome. She tried to put him in the trap and he instantly knew what was happening. Good for him for staying strong in this situation. And women wonder why men look at them. There's no other place to look. I'm just saying, like, if he's scared of me, it's good. Be scared. Scared because I got two guns on me at all times. Right there and right there. Yeah, I, don't, I got uh, two I on think me at all times. He's just like scared of you because like they're uncertain of your mental stability. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Says every crazy girl ever. I'm not crazy. Even with a girl in his life, Bradley Martin surely ain't no simp. You really listen to women? What was the question? <laughs> oh my god! I listen to anybody that has something to say that's valid. But if you're gonna go on a rant, I'm simply gonna throw it an occasional yes. Well, he gave her answer to her question in a second. Clearly, he doesn't listen to women. Again, I mean, can they make it any more obvious? If this isn't creeping on a man, I don't know what is. Dang, I've never seen a woman so invested in a dude casually walking down the street like this. This must be the most uncomfortable this guy has ever felt. Imagine trying to run on the treadmill with some random woman just staring at you. You rate me on a scale of 1 to 10. Looks high, personality, maybe not the best, but... You don't like my personality? We've only had a conversation for 30 seconds! I cook and clean, does that change anything? Cook and clean? Do. do you work? I mean, I have a degree, but my job is... What's your degree? Nursing. Why'd you quit? Because I'm making more money now! You want a sugar mama or what? She tried way too hard to get his attention, but he asked the right questions to avoid the red flags. And then the women still try to act like men are the ones staring. Would you pound me? What? I, no. Bruh. Only pound Asians. What did he say? Hey. Yo, what the f well, he has his type and wasn't going to settle for anything else. What is up, my ladies? I'm back with more tips on how to hit on that super hot guy at the gym, kicking things off with the shirtless mirror block ego lift. This one's a little complicated. It's not for beginners, but if executed correctly, it's incredibly effective. Number two, the stare down. You really got to lean into this tension on this one. That's what it's all about. Be subtle. If he catches you, because sometimes they do, just play it cool. Play it off. 
Number three, follow the leader. Now again, this one's a little complex, not good for beginners, but it can really demonstrate persistence and that you're not the type of person to take no for an answer, which honestly, you guys really like. And last but not least, number four, recording him without his permission. I'll warn you, he's gonna be all like, OMG, how dare you, but secretly he's gonna be like super flattered. After watching all those exposing gym creep videos, this video makes me realize how tough it is for men. They are literally set up to get exposed. Oh, here we go again. Seems like she's focused on the wrong thing when it comes to working out. If the world hates you, just remember that it has hated me first. And bro will in fact come out a great person in the end. Lesson learned. Stop asking guys out in the middle of their workouts. It's not the move. This creepy woman was watching me in the gym. She was throwing me off my rhythm. Her eyes was physically and emotionally hurting me. I was scared for my life. I just like cloud and want to go viral over minuscule things. I'm training in peace. Like, I just come in to work out and people just watching me just in the background. Like, get a life, like, not every single day. You want to see people just tap me every single day. Um, are you using this phone? Um, you know what, I'm done, you know. Oh. Yeah, you can use it, it's fine. And here's just an example of a woman staring at a man in the gym. It's not always the guys who are creeps. You've been put on this earth to test us men. And if you fold, you fold. But it's up to us how And you end up like Sylvie shoots. We're not supposed to fold. Okay, what are we supposed to do then? You don't bend, you just... <laughs> this is what you do. You walk away. You walk away. You walk away. And you say, sayonara. No, you just don't. You just say, you just leave. And then they go, oh no, I'm sorry, I was kidding. And they just leave for good. And you find a loyal woman. But like... Bradley Martin is truly an inspiration of a man. Notice how he focuses on one thing, his workout. Telling bodybuilders to move. Move. I'm sorry? Get out of the way. Yes, I need to stand here. Why? This is my booth. I think you're the one who needs to move. I need to move? Yeah. What if we both move? She's not only being rude, but not even arguing a valid point. Like, that clearly was not her booth. If this were a guy staring at a girl, he would be placed in cuffs immediately. Walks up to random hot guy at gym. What was she even thinking? And I don't say this lightly, this is the maximum amount of cringe if you ask me. How to properly ghost women. 
This is for the guys who are, you know, a little bit more successful with women. And if you're a guy who's not as successful with women, when you start becoming successful with women, this is what you got to do when you want to ghost the girl. You got a girl you don't want to even want to see no more. You know, it, it was all right. You not really feeling it. Guys, you always want to do it in a subtle way. You never want to just block the girl or stop responding to her text because you don't want a girl to be vindictive and accuse you of something that you didn't do. So, if you got a girl you don't want to see again, this is what you got to do. After, you know, you guys, you know, do the do, and you're like, I don't even want to see this girl again, tell her to text you when she gets home. And you're going to respond when she tells you she's home. And then, from then moving forward, when she asks to see you, you're going to be busy until she gets the point. That's how you probably ghost women. Never just ghost them completely. See, we still try to do it in the nicest way possible, even if it means ghosting a girl. Two girls creeping on a dude at the gym caught on camera. Evidence is right here, boys. Does this type of guy seem to ignore women? I'm gonna tell you why in this video. Let's get into it. Number one, they know their value. They value their time and attention, and they're not gonna use it to inflate a woman's ego. They're goal-driven. They are too busy chasing purpose to be chasing women. This type of guy does not need to be in a relationship. Trust me, he good being alone. So he's not desperate to fill up the space with a woman. He's calculated. He's strategic. And he probably knows a woman that he's interested in. A lot of guys want her too, and are probably giving her a whole lot of attention. And he ain't gonna be like everybody else, which is gonna make her wonder. This man does have a busy life. He has incredibly high standards for the women that he decides to pursue. So if he does decide to pursue you, he made a calculated decision to do so. Remember, just like she got options, he got options too, because he's confident and he's secure in himself. He doesn't need the validation of a woman's interests. He knows his value, and he knows his worth. At this point, I think we all know why he's ignoring women. Hint, the gym is his best friend. See, all it took was focusing on his own self for a few months, and now look at him, getting all the girls without even trying. You guys have made it to the end. Make sure to like and subscribe to prove you're an alpha. And remember, according to YouTube, the best way to help the channel and the algorithm is to watch another one of my videos right after this video. So if you like this video, you should watch another one. Till next time.